what is going on guys welcome back to another video in this video i just want to walk you guys through my investments what i'm currently going big on so the top two right here are going to be tron and ripple uh also you could say litecoin i'm pretty big on but i just want to tell you guys why so the first one uh tron here i have seventy five thousand tron close to 0.7 bitcoin it's about ten thousand dollars let's just see that or Bitcoin to USD. Let's see what that says here. So, even more. That's eleven thousand. So that, it went up a bit. I actually already made my profits on both of these. I just want to hold them. I'm mainly in it for the long run. I'm hoping to see Tron hit a dollar in the future. Uh, Ripple. I couldn't even believe that it hit three dollars. I couldn't even believe it hit two dollars. I invested at a dollar. Uh, so I've already three uh, xed my investment here. So that's fantastic. Uh, even less, I invested in 90 cents, so it's really nice seeing it uh, come up a lot. And uh, Litecoin, I just invested today, so hopefully it goes up. You know, the Litecoin market is currently down, so Litecoin is at maybe 230. I saw it last. I'm hoping it jumps back up. It had a high of like 390 uh, a while ago, so hopefully we see something like that come back and I can maybe close to double. You know, that would be nice, so yeah. So let's jump into why I like Tron. So let's hop on over to this site. So Tron is currently partnered with this company here. I think it's big because they have 10 million users that have this and it's currently worldwide. And those users all have the potential to use uh, Tron. So that's really cool for them. I think it's pretty lit. They don't have it in the US, but they do have it in many, many places. So uh, here you have South Korea on here. You have... Uh, United Kingdom, uh, Italy, what else? That you have a lot of places, really. Uh, I haven't been to any of these places. I've been to the UK, but nothing else here. Uh, let me see. I haven't been to any other place but the UK. So, yeah, but that's really cool. This uh, pretty sick uh, thing here. You can rent a bike. It's sort of like city bike here in the US, how you use your Citibank card to start riding those bicycles. So, it's pretty cool. Uh, yes, yeah, so I think it's a really nice thing not only that but also the owner of this used to work uh, for ripple So let's, if you scroll down he former chief of representative in greater China of ripple So that's really cool and he was on Forbes twice for Forbes Asia 30 under 30 and Forbes China 30 under 30 So that's really cool uh, If you guys want to check this out I'll have links to all this in the description and I think the the owner of the bike here Yeah, so this is the guy that created it uh, founder of oh no this is another bike thing oh for, so I guess they're big with bicycles so yeah that's pretty lit uh, if you guys search it up you do Tron O bike you see this so O bike partners with them so it's pretty cool uh, now let's get on to the next thing here it's really late so that's why I'm not too energetic right now so if we hop on over to the next thing uh, which is five reasons tr uh, ripple I actually use this uh, as a big reference for why I'm so into Ripple. American Express, obviously huge, huge company. Really, you can't, like, they're an unbeatable company, you know? They're they're one of the top companies right now for cards. So that's a huge, huge thing they have with uh, American Express. It's not exactly American Express, but it's like their child company that they're partnered with. So it's really cool to see that. Uh, they're very big in Asia. They're already in many banks all over Asia. So Ripple's already being, uh, being used. And then the Coinbase rumors, if it does get on Coinbase, we can easily see a $5 increase or a $5 price point at XRP. So if it does hop on Coinbase, we can easily see $5. That'd be huge. That'd be close to five times my investment. So that'd be fantastic. Uh, the functionality is fantastic. It's super quick, four second transaction. So it's really, it's a super cool thing. Uh, it's really just like, it's like the US dollar of digital currencies really, because it's not too crazy like Bitcoin. We're not going to wake up and see a $2,000 decrease or anything like that. It can go up and down, I'd say 10 cents. And that's what I'm seeing basically every day. It hovers around like a 10 cent thing here. So if we hop on over to the basic uh, exchange here and we see what it's at. I think last I checked it was at $3 or something like that. Uh, let's see, $3.20 or something. So three seventeen. So it was going crazy. Today I bought some at, uh, let's see, I bought a lot. Today I bought... Where is it at? XRP. I bought at 19. Let's see how much that is. I bought it at 294. So I already made my money on that. That's awesome, you know. 
So I bought twice. I tried to buy it all in one, but it was giving me some error. I'm not sure. So I bought it 850, 850. And then I bought 40,000 Tron coins on top of the 30 something thousand I already had. So that was pretty lit. And then I also bought some light coins. So I bought 10 light coins worth about 2,000 maybe. Yeah, so 2.4K. So yeah, uh, these are my current investments. Uh, we can hop back on to the deposits and withdrawals here and you guys can see the rest of them. Uh, Ether, this is a bullshit investment. Uh, it's not a lot, it's maybe like $300, probably less. Uh, Dash, is, uh, it's an all right investment. I, I think I have like a thousand in this maybe. Whoops, that can't be right. Let's get this number. <laughs> Oh, oh five. That's less than a thousand. I have seven fifty in that, so that's that's not too bad. Uh, what else do I have? I have uh, some Bitcoin, of course. That's a lot of it. Maybe like over two thousand here. Three point four. So yeah. So uh, those are my current investments. Uh, I highly recommend you hop on Tron, uh, Ripple, and Litecoin. I'm not a professional. Uh, I'm not a professional financial expert or any of that. These are just like my insights. Uh, I guess you could say I have an eye for these things. A lot of people would like try to read the charts and stuff. Although you can like see the ascending triangle or descending triangles and sort of predict price points, it's mainly based off hype. That's what I've seen with cryptos. It's really, really, really close. To, it's a uh, really uh, attached to the hype. Like mainly, the hype kills those charts and all those. Honestly, it does. If if like for example we see Ripple hop on Coinbase, I don't care what chart you're looking at, it's gonna affect it greatly. So, or even if it doesn't, and something happens, or one of the owners of Ripple sells all their coins and that gets revealed, the chart doesn't matter what the chart says. If it's an ascending triangle and you think it's gonna break out uh, and double or whatever, if an owner sells all his Ripple, people are gonna start getting feared of like what's happening, and they would sell all theirs too. So. You know, it's, anything can happen. It's all about the hype, in my opinion. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, drop a like. I'll have some more videos with updates of uh, how much I'm making here on Tron, Ripple, and Litecoin. Uh, yeah, thank you guys so much. Peace out.